happy September, everyone. It's September 1st, 2023 in Big Bear Lake. We are getting some rain at the moment. These storms look like, or these clouds really look pretty intense, you guys, but unfortunately there wasn't that much moisture involved in ours, but now a red cell popped up, so we're gonna be out driving around. We're gonna head towards the cell right now, and hopefully we catch something pretty good and pretty heavy because our lake needs it. Hope everyone's doing well. It is 8 p.m. and uh, say hi to... Hey guys, <laughs> it's raining. It is raining. So I have a feeling when we're gonna drive over towards the dam. We might even do like a nice little drive around the lake just to, uh, yeah, because the heavy stuff is coming in over the dam right now. So I, I kind of wanted to intercept it. But down the mountain in the desert area, there is there's some really incredible, incredibly heavy storms pounding the desert right now. Wow. As I said, we are driving in, into the storm right now. I know it's kind of hard to see out of the windshield, but just give it a second. This is the type of precipitation we do need up here frequently. If you keep your eyes peeled, the sky could light up a little bit from this storm, so hopefully we'll see some lightning. I'm telling you what, the storm is, as I said, it's so heavy in the deserts right now. In the high desert, out by Nipton, and all, all, well, that, that's not necessarily the high desert, but it, well, is it? I don't know. It's pretty far away from here, but the storms look humongous out there. The radar just looks so scary. But yeah, we are, uh, definitely do the best we can to catch whatever we can up here. You guys know I love to do this. It makes me happy. I just washed my car, but I didn't need to because of this. I'm kind of sad because this is probably maybe the last few weeks of me boning this car. So, it's going to be sad. I've had it since December 2019, or 2018 actually. It's a 2019 Crosstrek, but I am selling it. Oh yeah, it's definitely raining to get here now. I love it. Apparently this weekend we were supposed to have a fireworks show up here that I didn't know about. I had no idea. Do we have it for uh, Labor Day? Yeah. Do we Let's have look that up. any? Well, no, it's it's canceled. No. Do we have any uh, paper towels in here? Paper towels? No. Uh, we have a towel. Yeah. Let, let me use that real, real quick. All of that's on the outside, yeah. That is on the outside. I washed my, my windshield really well for you guys. So, we're doing the best we can here. One of the huge differences between the rain and the, the heavy rain and the heavy snow is that during our snowstorms, I usually don't have any problems seeing out of our windshield. It looks so beautiful driving. This 
way, that heaviest part of the cell coming through we should be driving into. So again, keep your eyes peeled for some lightning in the sky, brightening up the whole night. I think that, that would make my night bright. chance for frequent lightning tonight and uh, hail as well. I'd much rather have the lightning than the hail. some sort of an event. Every one of these three day weekends they always have something. This way to drive around the lake instead of the other way because this way we're going against the grain and we're not going to hit any traffic at all. Yeah, it's really, it, it feels like winter time. It feels like the amount of people that come up during our snowstorms. I can't believe the lightning. I know, it's crazy, isn't it? Yeah. 
uh, from the tropical never storm. Gets, yeah. Uh, filled, but well, do you remember which, careful, which, you which side of the road? On there, uh, it's right? coming in, in, okay. coming in. All right, so, yeah, um, it's right around here, you guys. It's one that keeps on opening up. It's not when you're leaving, it's when you're arriving. So, just be careful with the head. Oh yeah, it's really coming down. your written forecasts you guys go to bensweather.com I'm more of a visual forecast I'll, I'll post his forecast on the community section of our channel but if you guys want to read about what's predicted for this area go to Ben's weather every day and check it out once again it's bensweather.com get as excited as, as I do but she she does I'm turning her into kind of a mild weather person she enjoys cruising and she helps me a lot of times with uh, let me know when she's in a certain part of town if there's any weather going on and stuff like that she saved us a lot of videos you guys well even before we met I would drive around around the lake so we have that in common and now because he does the weather yeah I definitely um, if I see anything going on I'll call him the time it helps a lot you guys it helps a lot
right, so we're on Highway 38. I don't know why my GPS is showing us the whole country right now, but. Oh, you know what? It's because I had to reset my phone, my other phone. So we've got my one iPhone that I use for just random stuff in the car. The iPhone I'm using for the camera right now and my iPhone I'm using for my regular phone. Lock the chickens up, by the way. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I just didn't put their their blankets down. They're so good. They are so good. day you guys I've been waiting for this to potentially happen because it wasn't set in stone at all even an, an hour before it arrived about an hour ago and an hour and a half ago it showed that er, that all the moisture was going to stay well away from us but that's what the mountains do they definitely mess with the storm track Hills of Fonskin over there look so beautiful. All the lights up in the hills. It reminds me of uh, this, this neighborhood near where I grew up called Spyglass Hill. So beautiful. Okay, we're driving into the eagle habitat area as well, you guys. So on the left-hand side over here, this is where the eagles have their nest. He's a rock star. The guy is super talented. And uh, he has a YouTube channel called The Solo Gigging Life. I've referred him to you guys a lot. He's, he's a super good dude. Has amazing, um, as I said, amazing music. Like songs that I really, really like. In fact, I, I could probably play that, that, that one song. 
I don't know if you guys want to hear a song in the background, but I don't mind playing one of Jeffrey's songs. If we get copywritten, we get copywritten. But he's a good dude. He's got lots of beautiful songs. But let's see here. I'll shut up so we can cruise and listen to this cruising melody here. Dude rocks. How do I start the song over, babe? Oh, let's see. There we go. All right, you guys ready? stuff huh guys that's our friend Jeffrey he lives up here 
Um, he's been traveling, playing in some big bands many, many years ago, bands that were known. I'm, 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 I'm pretty sure, I can't remember what some of the names were, but lots of uh, metal bands. If you look at him, you would, you would think definitely metal. He's like six foot seven, like 280 pounds, tattoos everywhere. Just the nicest guy in the world though, just the nicest guy. And he found me because of the channel. And uh, you know, he is super cool. I took to him and uh, he's been trying to get his uh, channels off, off the ground for a while. And they're really good channels regarding music and uh, how to use certain equipment and just his solo gigging career. He just played a big show in front of a few thousand people in Mammoth last week, and um, yeah, he's, he's, he's just a, a super good dude. I'm gonna bring him on at least one winter ride this winter so you guys can meet a good friend of mine and, and yeah, show him some love and support. But yeah, how cool has the road been looking, guys, driving? It looks like we're driving through like fog rising like from Halloween it totally does it totally does that's a good way to put it babe i want to do a halloween costume theme with nick he's 50 50 about it but he's definitely 100 percent gonna do it <laughs> i'd say i'm about 10 90 about it <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna be uh raggedy ann and andy yeah yeah <laughs> You're raggedy smoking something. <laughs> Just kidding. Actually, I I wouldn't mind. Really? Yeah. You dressed up as Andy? Oh, you don't want me to be Ann? Oh, you want to be raggedy Ann? <laughs> <laughs> sure. I do wear the pants in the family, so I guess that would be more appropriate. Well, then you should wear both raggedy and D. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, that's going to be our heavy our little bit of torrential rain that we got over by Fonskin, that was pretty awesome. That was heavier than even uh, the heaviest I drove into during the tropical storm. So I'm glad we got to experience that. That was great. I'm glad you guys got to listen to my friend Jeffrey. And, uh, yeah, that was awesome. Yeah. Love the Mexican girl song. Totally. Totally. Totally, totally. So. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for being here. I second that. Thank you for watching. Thank you for being here. And, uh, we appreciate all the support, all the love. Again, if you feel like we've earned a subscription, please subscribe. If you haven't, hit the, hit the like button. I'd appreciate it. It does help. And uh, yeah, let's look forward to a really awesome winter coming up. I know I'm getting a little over my skis. Had to use a winter analogy there. but uh, Or is that a metaphor? I, it's, it's, it's one of the two. It sounded good. So that's all that counts. But uh, anyway, thank you guys again for everything. We love you a lot, and uh, I will be checking you guys a little bit later. Peace out. It's September 1st, 2023 at 8.30 p.m.